guys, we're back with some, with some more science. science. Right, we're making crystals. Oh, yes. So, Harry, that salt, pour into but that mug. But you mean mug. a You'll see. Pour that salt into that mug. All of them. Yeah, pretty much. So, put the salt in. Yeah, salt okay. in. Move that cup down a bit because you're a bit close to the steam. I will add some fairly, fairly hot water. Is it? It's mm -hmm. not really hot though. Is no, it? give it a stir pop. Harry, you're going to add some food colouring. Oh, I would die if I drink that. Not too much. Now, just think about this. The more food colouring you add, the darker it's going to be. So you've got to keep stirring pop till we get rid of all the salt. So stir a little bit harder and we want all that salt to dissolve. At the, mind your fingers a minute. At the moment, it's still a little lumpy. Mm. So I might need to add a bit more water in a minute. So put in the food colouring, Harry. The lighter it is, the pinker it will be and the easier it will be to see through. So just mind your fingers a second. Just I add some do. more hot water. Yep. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> and then suck some up in the syringe, please, Harry. I'll be. Have you given it another stir pop? Um. Has the salt dissolved? I can't tell now. No, no. All right, keep going until the salt dissolves. So keep stirring until we get rid of all that salt. Okay. How's it looking now, pop? Well, still got. That salt's not dissolved very well, is no. it? What have we done wrong? So. What we've done is we we've kind of like separated them. We've added some more hot water, and we have put it back together. Mm -hmm. And the shot's kind of gone, but it'll have to do the best because the best we can do. So, right, Harry? so get in deep as you can with your plunger, Harry, and get so you can get in a lot Harry, of the salt as well. Lots of salt. Lots. Right, yeah. the plate hot plate. Now the plate is hot. Yeah. On on a pan of steam. Why is that steaming a lot more than normal? Because there's a plate on it. Uh, because it's, it's trapping, trapping all, all the heat okay, inside right. of it. Right, squirt it onto the plate gently. Don't make a big hairy mess. Well, that's chilling, isn't it? It comes out like really fast. Logs, isn't it? Is evaporating, right? Mm -hmm. The water, as we talked about earlier, and it is building salt crystals. Can you see in the middle already where it's drying? Yeah, yeah. And it, you've got like a, a mountain. We should do more like a whole plate of it. Go on then. I think. Right. What? It's like... So it's forming, don't don't smash them, it's forming tiny little crystals. Now, the longer we leave it, the more the water's going to evaporate. Look at this. Yeah, pour it all in. Just carefully, don't make a mess. Hold the container for a Harry. Poppy, you're pouring it on the counter. Oh, <laughs> Let me do it. Yeah, I've got it. I can't do it. Oh, <laughs> I don't like salt. If there's any salty bits, pull it out and then give it another stir in there. Yeah. Now, we're going to leave that in a window or somewhere warm to evaporate on its own. It will take a few days. Now, the crystals will be a lot bigger. Why? Because it's a lot more salt. Nope. Because there's more room to do it? And less heat. Less heat is right. So less heat means it happens... Quicker. The other Slow. way. Slower. So the salt sticks better, so the salt crystals become bigger and more natural. And then later we're going to be looking at real live form salt crystals. But if you can see your salt crystals are big coming along quite <coughs> nicely. How long do we leave them for, Dad? Um, well, really, it's evaporated and the plate's dry, so don't touch it. Mm. It's going to be really hot now. So, as you can see, it's looking along really goodly. Can try really and goodly? Really goodly. Goodly. Really well. Really well. And you, if you get really close to it, now be careful of your hands. Dad, 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 you, your hands really close. Just kidding. <coughs> if you look really closely, you can just see those little sparks and the crystals starting to jump together. It comes together. If you wonder what these blobs are, it's just where Dad's just blobs and so on, isn't it? So that's it drying out. So what if we lumped it together a little bit and okay. see if it would make a bit of a big one? Okay, I need to be careful. Mind the steam. So you this side of the steam, bring it to me and just scrape ah. it up. And they are tiny little pink salt crystals. Should I do it all? Yeah, just come this side so you're away from the steam. Uh, don't hug me again. What's it yeah. feel like, Pop? It feels like... Very um, pretty. It feels like... Sand? It feels like wet sand that's just been dried in a little bit in front of the, um, in the beach there where it's like started, it's, it's, it's gone over, yeah? Mm -hmm. It's gone over, it's wet and then stopped wetting it then. Do you know what, do you know that? Yeah. Yeah, it's like that. 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 Ye
So it's that. Wet, but it's dried up as well. But it's still kind of not wet. So making sure you're paying and attention. How would you, if you had only salt water to drink and you needed to extract the salt, how would you capture the water to drink? Oh. I, well, I would put, I would get it, mm -hmm. yeah, get the, the salt water, and I would put it somewhere. Mm -hmm. And I Made would, it up square. I would. Gotcha. I would get like a top. Eggshell. Yeah. And um. then underneath, I would get like a little car mm -hmm. that would catch all the water and then drip it into like. How would the tarp catch the water and how would it get hot? Heat. What? Fire. Where, where's your heat Fire. from? Fire. What else? Boiling water. Sun. Sun. So you could boil the water. Mm. It's a rainy day. Right. So if. Obviously, this is on a plate to catch the salt, but if we were doing it the other way around, we could capture uh, and the pan. If we were doing this the other way around, yeah, and we boiled the salt water, mm -hmm. this here, this steam, yeah. would be pure water and the salt would stay in the pan. So you could put it in a pan, boil it, but then how would you catch the steam so it didn't escape? Oh, so if it went up, get the top, but underneath it have a massive container which would drip into it and then drop onto it and then fresh water. Yeah, I mean the best thing for collecting steam is something shiny and smooth and glass. Glass, yeah. You could get a container yep. at a bit of an angle. So you get the container, yeah. make a box if you like, but mm -hmm. put a sloped lid on it. Yeah? Yeah. Line it with black lining. Why black? Would attract to it? Nope. Black attracts heat. Yeah, it does. So that's why you don't really wear it black. It soaks in. Yeah. So if it's a really hot day, you'd be better off wearing a white t-shirt than a black t-shirt because the black soaks up the heat. Then, if you put like a glass lid on it, right, the heat from the sun would heat up the water eventually. It would evaporate. The salt would stay at the bottom. And then it would, because it was at a slope, at an angle... It would run down the glass and then you could collect it in like a gutter or oh. something. And then obviously it'd be warm and you'd have to cool it down and everything else. But you would be collecting pure water, water yeah. each time. Now, our salt is looking really, really good. How much longer do you want to leave it? Look at that. That's just pure oh, salt. Fine. Fine. So, would you sprinkle that on your chips? No. Why not? Well, I guess it is still salt, but it's, it's too much. Yeah, yeah. well, I'm all right. Then we'll just sprinkle a little bit on your chips. Maybe. So, if in the future, Harry, you wanted to impress a girl and cook a meal for her, mm. you could make her your very special pink. pink salt and go, oh, I don't bother with the Himalayan salt. I make my own pink salt because <laughs> I'm just cool. Yeah, yeah. Couldn't you? Yeah. So, that is one science experiment. That worked fairly good. Fairly good? Can I touch it? Fairly goodly. Right. Hang on. Thank you. I would eat this now. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like. See if you can. Pink snow. It does a bit, doesn't it? Touch What's it. so special about the yellow snow? Don't eat it. it. Mm -hmm. Is it hot? No. Pop? It's, it's, quite, it's quite warm. But not too hot that you can't touch. No, I can still touch it. Oh, it's can very you... salty. Oh. Is it, Harry? Very salty. <laughs> what? Like Why would water. that be? Why would that be? Do I have 99% of its salt? Why would it be so salty? Right, see if you can squeeze all that lot together and make a shape. Oh, it's a lot saltier than usual because you, what, it, was it's just, more salty. it was just like one green and I did it and it was like, uh, uh, very salty. It is extra It is more salty. Yeah. You're right. Why is it more salty than normal salt? Have you extra salt something? That does taste more salty. Does the food colouring make it more salty? You're bleeding annoying, that's food colouring. <laughs> right, Pop, don't get any salt in your cut because it will sting. It does. You've just discovered it the hard way, have you? So, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> Comment down below what you're doing in another video. Bye, guys! Poppy's off to be hairdresser. Bye! <laughs>